Hi, my name is Mike from Avanti R&D here at ITS World Congress 2018 in Copenhagen. So how it works is as a cyclist passes in front of our sensor, which uh, we have a mock-up here, we are using a off-the-shelf components and in the back of our sensor, we have a processor which analyzes the video. And what we are showing here is our traffic monitoring system for bicycles. As the cyclist passes in front of our sensor, creates an ID file, a small ID file, which then gets passed from the uh, detection sensor to subsequent sensors. Then, as those sensors uh, are monitoring the road, they wait and to see if they can detect the same cyclists. Then they compare all the cyclists that they're able to detect, and if it matches that ID file it received, uh, then we have a re-identification and based on the timing we can uh, estimate travel times along certain segments of road. Uh, this is actually an extension of the traffic monitoring system that we've developed for vehicles. And all of this is together with Rada Manufacturing. Uh, so we have sensors installed here uh, as well as here in Copenhagen. Um, and for the traffic monitoring system, we are detecting vehicle count, speed, and classification on a per lane basis. So we decided to extend that technology and try to apply it to a unique use case uh, that the Copenhagen government was interested in, which is the bicycle travel times. So we cooperated with the government and we have been able to install and are now testing uh, in Copenhagen.